presidential campaigns expose the true nature of a politician's makeup. One Democrat learned that lesson the hard way, and that's because this top Trump challenger made one confession that had everyone talking treason. Bernie Sanders is one of the top contenders for the Democrat Party nomination. While his campaign sagged in the spring and early summer, recent weeks saw Sanders regain his polling momentum and continue to draw large crowds on the campaign trail. But while Sanders is gaining momentum with the radical left-wing Democrat Party base, Sanders made a campaign-killing confession. In an interview with The Hill.TV, Sanders was asked for his thoughts on if China posed an existential threat to the American worker. Sanders began his answer by outrageously stating he would not call China an existential threat despite the fact that China regularly steals American intellectual property, spies on Americans, and gutted the American middle class through one-sided trade deals and currency manipulation. Amazingly, things went downhill from there. Sanders claimed no country on earth did more to address poverty than the Chinese. We have to say about China, in fairness to China and its leadership, is if I'm not mistaken, they have made more progress in addressing extreme poverty than any country in the history of civilization. It is no surprise that Sanders would praise the communist Chinese government. After all, Sanders spent his honeymoon in the Soviet Union, but Sanders didn't tell the whole story. Chairman Mao and the Chinese government addressed poverty by slaughtering their own citizens. During Mao's Great Leap Forward, where the chairman transformed China into a command and control socialist economy, between 30 and 50 million Chinese starved to death. In addition, 2.5 million Chinese citizens were beaten or tortured to death. Because of Donald Trump's trade negotiations with Beijing, China will be a defining issue in the 2020 election. Bernie Sanders failed the commander-in-chief test in the eyes of millions of voters because of his cavalier attitude toward the threat posed by China. If you were sick and tired of all the fake news from the so-called mainstream media and want real news that you can trust, please hit the subscribe button on Black Eye Politics' YouTube channel.